Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the Sullivan family. So it is part one. I'm going to say it's part one because there will be two parts of Joseph's. I'm getting out Joseph's five to six clothes. Um, obviously, he was already five, but a lot of his stuff still fits him. In fact, some of the stuff he has in his drawer is already five to six. Um, newer things that have been bought and stuff, stuff he got for Christmas. But there is a whole load of stuff put away from the other boys of five to six so we are going to get all this stuff out see what we've got i'll show you guys what we've got and and then part two will be putting it all away um i've had to close the curtains because it's really sunny and i don't like starting the sun out but you can't see me um but it's also showing up all the dust i hate dust so anyway i will show you what we have for five to six Olivia's going to pass me all the stuff. Uh, so he has a Minecraft t-shirt, which is brand new. Um, I think some of the stuff he may have got a few years ago, we've put it away because it was too too big for him. Everything was too big for him. Um, but he'll like that. That's cool. He will like that. I'm pretty sure there's quite a lot of t-shirts. Yeah. Um, there's these ones. These were Noah's and Toby's. There is quite a lot of t-shirts of them they look quite big, big but these are small. i don't know Josie's still quite tiny um yeah. i mean he's five and a half but he is quite small so a lot of his four to five stuff does still fit him but it is starting to get a bit short and a bit just looks too small so um i don't know if they are age six they look quite yeah age six they might be a wee bit big but we can just put them at the back of the drawer would be a problem He's wearing one t-shirt that's six to seven at the moment, but it's, it fits him okay. I really like that one. Spider-Man. So they've all liked Spider-Man. Not quite as much as Joseph likes Spider-Man. I don't know where that was from. I think that might be next. Oh, I don't know. That was Noah's. And then Toby's. I think most of this stuff was Noah's and then Toby's t-shirt there's like a lot of t-shirts t-shirt it smells nice too t-shirt oh that was a bit worn out some of this stuff well, some of the stuff i put away as i said before and when you get it back out again it's not um what's the word i'm looking for storage it's not stayed in very good condition most of the times when you put stuff in the vacuum bags it sucks with the air out it's fine but it does tend to swimming costumes are one thing because the chlorine just breaks the material down um and sometimes t-shirts i mean that'll be okay for just playing out in was that noah's yeah, okay. i can't remember if it was noah's or toby's i know they both used to like adventure time um superheroes there'll be a lot of superhero fun stuff featured in this as you will see avengers and also a lot of t-shirts oh that's just a plain one plain t-shirt always handy <clears throat> i don't even remember that one it's probably given to me because it's a mini Bowden one, which I love, but um, that one's a nice one. Oh, that's cute. That's a mini Bowden one. Too. Oh, that one was Noah's. He doesn't, he's not overly keen on long sleeve tops. He prefers to wear a t shirt and then a jumper if it gets cold, but. It's sometimes it's handy to have some, um, even if he doesn't really wear them all that much. Star Wars. He's not really taken to Star Wars yet, is he? No. No, we used to love Star Wars. More. These are all long sleeve ones. These were all Noah's and then Toby's. Toby's never really liked. Um, long sleeve tops all that much either no one only wears t-shirts now but they all, all the boys prefer t-shirts really 
to wear in long sleeves. Shirts. Nobody used to wear them a bit, which is why there's quite as many as there is long sleeved. Uh, short sleeved, sorry. It's quite a cute one. You might like wearing some of them. I'll put them in his drawer anyway. You never know. Christmas top. Did that used to light up? I swear that used to light up. It might not light up anymore. Always handy to have Christmas tops. And Christmas jumpers. I used to like this one. This was Toby's. Because he wanted a flip sequin one that the girls had. So we managed to find a boys one for him. I mean, he could have had a girls one if he wanted, but he didn't. He wanted a boys one of them. Oh, I don't remember that one. That one? That's a nice one. That's quite a nice shirt. He, like, he did like you wearing shirts. Yeah, just a little shirt, just in case. He wore one at Christmas. He did wear a shirt at Christmas. Um, sometimes handy to have. If you go anywhere, really smart. He did like wearing his one at Christmas. More jogging bottoms. Not see here at the moment. He he lives in jogging bottoms because he was wearing like um, soft kind of jeans. They're almost like jogger jeans, um, but they are denim material. And he was wearing them, but just lately he doesn't want to wear them. Yeah. Last time we put them on, he'd only wear them if we were going out somewhere um, because he likes his jogging bottoms. But last time we put them on, he said they were itchy and he didn't like them. Um, and they're like the softest ones that we could find. Um, he just doesn't really like wearing jeans, which is fine. Um, he just prefers to wear joggers. So he's got pairs of joggers that do fit him, but some of his Spider-Man ones and stuff for four to five are getting too small. But although these ones look like they might be too big. But mind you, he's got, we bought him a tracksuit in Poundland the other week. And that's five to six, and the bottoms are fine. They're a wee bit big around the waist, yeah. aren't they? But they're fine. I'm not sure how many pairs of joggers we'll have put away because Noah used to go through the knees like you've never seen. Um, I've got those ones. I'm not sure if he'll like those ones, but he might do because they're like double lined. He's not keen on two. In fact, he spends half the time with no trousers on because he just doesn't like the feeling. He loves it when he can wear, he'll wear shorts, um, he likes shorts happily, but obviously he also gets quite cold. So we, you know, to go out and stuff, we put trousers on. But at home, he's happier either with nothing or, short. or shorts, um, which is fine. I'm not sure how many pairs of shorts we've got either. But some of his shorts again, and we've got two pairs of them, black and blue. They're quite good for playing out in the garden because they're kind of double lined. Yeah, these jeans. See, neither of the other boys likes wearing jeans that much. No, actually, I tell a lie. Mm. Noah li liked them. Toby didn't really like the feeling of jeans either, which is why we've got lots of ones with elasticated waists and stretchy and elasticated bottoms. Um, I think Next used to do really nice ones like that. I'm not sure where these came from. Doesn't say we've cut the label out, obviously because it was itchy. Things like labels and stuff really used to an annoy um, Joseph and Toby as well. Don't like them. Those are quite nice. Uh, I don't know where they came from. I don't think that. They're quite nice, but I don't think he'll wear them. Some of these I might um, put aside because I don't think that Noah will. Toby, Joseph, Joseph will wear them. He might wear those at a push, I'm not sure he, though. Maybe he might wear them because they're, they're quite long. They're they look massive. The feet, he might wear them. Mm, he possibly will. He might put them at the back of his drawer, you never know. They've got elasticated waists, but they are quite, I don't know. He might keep hold of them just in case. Um, I'm not even sure if wear them. Christmas jumper. Oh, it lights up still. You can see it. Christmas jumper.
Oh, a little fleece. You like that? Yeah. These little fleeces are always really handy, especially in the winter. You put them on because they're thin. So it's like another layer to put on um, over a top, but underneath a, ja uh, a jacket or snowsuit or whatever. They're always quite handy to have. He quite likes zippies as well um, because he's not keen on um, things going over his head so much. So like he hoodies. Mind his sweatshirts. No, he's not too bad with his sweatshirts, but hoodies he doesn't like because the hood obviously gets a bit stuck. He doesn't like. He just doesn't. He, we've developed a kind of way when he broke his arm. We developed a way of getting his tops on and off, which actually is kind he of does. he still does now because he finds it easier so he puts one arm in then he puts his head in then he puts the other arm in um so he will wear he does like his leopard fox jumper yeah he will wear a hoodie if it's bigger like his leopard fox one is bigger um but you kind of you can't put any that are tight or small or anything so sometimes dippies are are easier for him so all these little things that you find out that um and they're just little things that make him really distressed. that are easily kind of fixable, really. I like this one. There's quite a few. Oh, he'll like this one. Zippies are much easier for him. Um, like I said, because he can just zip them up. and doesn't have to go over his head. Oh, shorts. They're quite nice little shorts. Mm -hmm. Shorts. He's like the other boys in wearing shorts. Shorts. They look quite long. Oh, they're longer shorts. They would definitely know us. Mm -hmm. They're like long jean shorts. These sure. Ones nice. These ones were nice. I think they were totally yeah. Denim ones. See, they're quite soft and don't really feel like denim. Some of these might just, I'm not sure if he'll wear. Swim shorts. So, like swim shorts. He likes swim shorts. Swim shorts right now still fit him though. Although he doesn't like going swimming. But um swim shorts. We've yet to get him back in the pool. He's been he swimming. He did like it before he broke his arm. Kind of. No, it didn't. No, he was just didn't we show him the swim pool and was just getting in. He to was it. gonna think about getting in. Last time we took him swimming, if you remember was when he was little and he screamed the place down yeah. and then we took him again thinking they might have got him used to it and he screamed the place down again and he hated it and then we just got him round to thinking that he might like to go and try swimming again and then he broke his arm and we haven't tried again since these ones are always great for the boys little jersey ones because they're soft they're comfortable he likes um and he likes these ones as well these like little football ones football shorts because again they're light and they're soft and comfortable with elasticated waists. Screw uniform. Oh, screw uniform. Shorts. Or more shorts. White ones. I used to have a little white t shirt that would have gone with that. Oh, more shorts. Are you sure that's not his size right now? Well, it might be. Because he's got the matching t shirts and bottoms right now. Yeah. What size are they? Six. They look a bit big. I think I might have to get him some more. These PE shorts. Oh, yeah, I've got a really itchy nose. PE shorts. PE shorts, but he'll probably quite like wearing them. Yeah. Because they're um soft. More shorts. His other shorts are starting to get too small. More PE um, So he does need more shorts. I don't know why I've got so many pairs of PE shorts. Yeah, why not? To be fair, I have no, I have no clue as to why I have so many pairs of pea shorts. Skill trousers. I've got some school uniform. They look like massive. I like these little shorts. Yeah. yeah. They also look a bit gone on these, but um, again, Toby and Noah didn't do very well in uniform. I was only able to shorts. save a few school shorts, save a few bits. I don't know what it is with boys and skidding on their knees, no but um, no one must have just worn shorts. Just, no, I did just used to wear shorts. Both boys, anybody that watches us regularly will know that both boys wear shorts, um, even in the winter. Noah's, I can't remember the last time Noah actually wore a pair of trousers, 
He doesn't wear trousers. In fact, I don't think he has any trousers that fit him. I keep trying to get him to choose some, but he's like, I just don't like them. I don't like the trousers. I don't want to wear them. So I don't think he owns any. I keep saying to him, you need to just have a pair just in case. But then he has just gone through like one of the coldest winters in shorts. Yeah. So does he need any, really? He's quite happy in his shorts. So um, he's done like three winters now without wearing any trousers. So, you know, don't really. He wears shorts to school. He's got school shorts. He wears shorts all year round. He just does. In fact, a lot of the boys up here do. Yeah, everybody wears shorts. In, in wears shorts. So I don't see a problem. Um, anyway, I'll be back. Right, we've just got pyjamas left. That's it. Um, we have lots of pairs of pyjamas. We have Christmas ones. He does need new pyjamas because um, his are getting too small. We have more Christmas ones. Oh, more Christmas ones. And have little monster ones, which are cute, with little monsters on. Oh, there's a lot of pyjamas. Small pyjamas. Small. There's quite a lot of pyjamas, let's just say that. There's there's like these, and these, and these. Is that it? Yeah. So he's got quite a lot of pairs of pyjamas. And then a onesie, but he likes his right now. Oh yeah, he's got a onesie here. Um, he does like onesies, but he likes his Udi. He had a Spider-Man onesie, but it got too small. Um, it's quite cute. Is that a monkey? Yeah, that's cute. It's not a monkey. Or is it a bear? It's a bear. It's a bear. It's a bear. Um, he doesn't really wear it very much, does he? Nothing his Udi. Much. He's got a Spider-Man Udi now. He does wear it quite often. Does he? When he gets cold at night. I mean, I put it on when he's cold, but... Oh, he's, got, he's already got the coat so we had there was a coat in here a blue one um which he's already taken out because he loved it and he wanted to wear it um so he's already got that but um we've got another gilet he does already have one um a camo an orange camo one he quite likes wearing these he likes wearing them in the summer. um in the summer because obviously it still gets a bit chilly up here in the summer so it's always handy that one's quite thick um but yeah so that's kind of that's kind of everything um really i think we might uh have to get him some more tractor bombs because there's literally probably one pair that he'll wear um but i know that he does have some in his drawer maybe some more sweatshirts that already fit him yeah he might need some more sweat suits, sweatshirts might have to just get him a few track suits in fact poundland had some really good ones in um Tesco's of Asda have got some in as well at yeah, the moment. Those Spider-Man ones, isn't it? Yeah, I might just pick him up a few a few new track suits, so sweatshirts and and bottoms. But the next so in the next vlog, I'm gonna put all this to one side for now, and then in the next vlog I will go through his drawers and see what we have to put away that's too small see what's in there that still fits i think to be honest most of his four to five stuff will go away because it is getting too small but he has got five to six stuff in there as well um so we'll keep that out uh but it is a case of having to go through everything because it's not separated it's all just in there well the clothes are separated but the ages aren't uh seeing what we've got seeing what we could keep out um yeah so yeah i think that's kind of I think that's kind of it for this. Oh, sunshine. Um, okay, guys, so that is it for part one of my um, Joseph's uh, new, old, pre-loved, second-hand, hand-me-down clothes haul, if you want to call it. Um, I think once we do part two, we'll have a clearer view of what he does need. Socks. He might need some socks, actually. I didn't see any socks put away in there. He, I mean, he's got socks at the moment, but they are starting to get a wee bit small. In fact, we have a bit of a sock crisis going on. 
in the house at the moment. Everybody's socks all of a sudden seem to have holes in them. Um, Ben's socks, he's like, my socks have got holes. I'm like, how is everybody's son? All of a sudden, the kids' Nike socks um, just seem to have holes. And Toby's socks, uh, the twins. So I have to do a big sock order. Um, I have to get a load of new socks because I don't know why I put the, the girls in white socks for school because they always come back black but I still put them in white socks for school I don't really know why maybe I should put them in black because they can wear either but I don't know white socks just look nice don't they um but I do need to order more socks I need to get the twins some school socks uh Agnes needs some trainer socks Toby only really wears black trainer socks so he needs some trainer socks the girls and Noah all need some when I say the girls, I mean the older ones. Uh, they all wear Nike socks. They all need some more Nike socks. Um, and Ben needs some socks. So my socks, I think, are okay. Although I can get away with wearing the girls. Although when I get socks, uh, I do. Everyone has their own colour thread. But I've probably spoken about this before. Um, but I can't bear odd socks everywhere. It does my head in. So when we get socks in, everyone's got their own colour thread. And yes, I know it's time consuming to start with, but it's genius afterwards because when I'm sorting through washing, all that sort of stuff, I know exactly whose socks are whose because each sock has a tiny little, just I just sew a, a little coloured thread in. So everyone's got their own colour. Um, it's not really noticeable to anybody else, mm. but it means that I can differentiate between whose socks are whose. Apart from the Nike socks, I don't do it in them, I have to guess. Um, but although some of them are slightly different, Charlotte's are slightly different to the other girls and the other girls, um, just wear which, whichever and Lizzie doesn't have any. So she just wears black ones. Uh, and Noah's are black. So I can kind of, there's, there's different ways, but the majority of them I do put in little coloured threads so that it's easier for me when I'm sorting the washing. So a little bit of time in the first instance saves me a heck of a lot of time later as I found out with the tights because I've bought the twins and Agnes some tights um some snag tights and they are different sizes but when you hold them up after they've been out in the wash they don't look different sizes so I now don't know because I didn't put any thread in those I now don't know whose tights are whose until I go to put them on and realize that the ones the twins are wearing are too small so they must be Agnes's but I wish I'd put colours in them as well because it would have been a lot easier for me but anyway I've completely gone off subject here and I'm now talking about socks so that's it for this video guys um I'll be back with part two but for now I hope you've enjoyed the vlog don't forget to drop us a like and subscribe I keep going out of the sun if um you haven't already and we will see you in the next video